wanted to share another fine art piece with you guys today and the interesting thing about this one is that it started as one idea and ended up morphing into another and the final piece actually ended up being an image that I had thought about doing over a year ago but just hadn't found the right time or way to do it. Um, so the original idea, which I will probably come back to creating a different piece for later, was the idea of trust and letting go. And that's why the posture you see me doing is one of throwing my arms back and thrusting my chest out. The idea of opening up my heart and like releasing that, um, being vulnerable. Um, was the the original intent and I wanted to use a specific backdrop that I hadn't had the chance to use yet and I was really excited about incorporating into a piece because um, it's a beautiful backdrop and I love the colors of it and as I was working and building what I realized is the while I loved what I had created I knew that it had the potential to be more. And I think that's one of the really cool things about art is that you can start off with one idea and within minutes or hours or days of being invested into the project realize that either what you've created isn't what it could be or what you want it to be and you have to start all over or you can find a deeper meaning in it and make it even greater than you had originally planned. So what had started as a piece about trust and letting go ended up morphing into an idea of the leap of faith. Um, and when I first thought of creating an image about a leap of faith, it was in June or July of 20. 15 and we had just made the decision to let go of our control and give it all to God in our journey to grow our family and it was super scary um, our world our society we are taught that all things are within our control we are encouraged to shape our own lives and our own futures to take matters into our own hands all the times and there's nothing necessarily wrong with that but as a Christian person who has grown deeper in her faith and relationship with God, um, I realized through our journey of infertility that I, f I was finding comfort and control. <laughs> and I think that that happens for a lot of us. It's, it feels better when you feel like you're doing something and it can be super hard and scary to let go and let God have control, especially when we don't know what that means for us. If that means we get what we want, if we don't get what we want, how long we'll have to wait. And, and that was, you know, the very truth of our story was that we let go and didn't know when and or if we would ever get what we were hoping, which was a family. Um, so our first leap was walking away from IVF and it was terrifying because I, I, I felt like it was like giving up. But it was also kind of exciting because I knew that we were doing something that we had never fully done before and that we were releasing our future into God's hands. And I knew that because of that, we had the potential for something really amazing to happen if we just let it happen. So what you're wa watching in this video is the original idea and now the morph into the idea of the leap of faith. And what you'll notice too is because I didn't have a cliff face, <laughs> I made one. I got creative. I used a lake shot that I'd taken a long time ago and a picture of a rock I'd taken a long time ago. And I combined a, a sky, a back, a scenery background and a rock to build this landscape. Um, so if you take nothing else away from this 
uh, time-lapse video. I hope what you'll take away is that you have the ability to be immensely creative. You have the ability to take nothing and make something. That landscape did not exist except for Photoshop. So don't ever think that you can't create the idea in your head. Because for a long time, I put off this image because I was waiting for the perfect opportunity to photograph a cliff and realized that I had the potential to just create that space. And I am so happy with how this came together and how it unfolded because I'm able to share all of the wonderful insights with you today. I will talk to you guys again real soon.